Okay guys, so I'm just going to start off by using my Anastasia Beverly Hills pomade in the shade medium brown just to fill in my brows. Now I'm going to use my Maybelline Age Rewind concealer and I'm going to use that to clean up my brows but also use that as an eye primer as well. Now I'm going to go in with my Ulta Beauty palette and I'm going to be using the burnt orange looking shade and I'm just going to be putting that all in my crease. Now I'm going to go back into the Ulta palette and use the chocolate brown looking shade and I'm going to be putting that on my outer V. I'm also going to be taking that dark chocolate brown shade and putting that in my crease as well. Now I'm going to go back and use that burnt orange shade that I used previously and I'm going to put that right back in my crease to give the color more definition. Now I'm going to go back into the Ulta palette and use this light pretty pink shade and I'm going to put that right on my lid. Now I'm going to use the Bone White shade and I'm going to put it right on the end of my eyebrow just to give it a little bit of a pop. Now for the fun part, I'm going to be using a flat brush and my NYX Glitter Glue and I'm going to be placing the glue right on top of my lid where I'm going to be placing the glitter at. Baby, let's cut down the lights. I just really want to let this fire and bright. I'm going to be using my NYX red glitter, and I'm going to be placing that right on top of the lid. Now I'm going to be using the rose facial water and I'm going to be spraying that all over my face. Now I'm going to go in with my Cover FX primer 
and I'm going to be applying that only on the spots that I need it. Now I'm going to go in with my Milani foundation in the shade medium beige. I'm just going to be applying that all over my face. Now I'm going to be using a Kabuki brush just to blend that all out. Now I'm going to be applying my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade 25 and I'm going to be applying that under my eyes as well as the bridge of my nose. And to blend all this out, I'm going to be using my Real Technique sponge. I'm just going to make sure that's all blended in really good. Now I'm going to be baking my under eyes using the CoverGirl Professional Loose Powder in the shade 110 and I'm also going to be using this powder to set the rest of my face. Now I'm going to be using my NYX Contour Palette and I'm going to be using two dark shades just to give my face a little bit of a bronze. Now I'm going to be using my NYX Baked Blush and just applying that to my cheekbones. Now I'm going to be using my L'Oreal Butterfly Mascara and I'm just applying it to the top lashes to prep for falsies. I'm also going to be using the NYC Liquid Liner to make a wing. Today I'm going to be applying my Ardell 106 lashes. I'm just going to apply some glue and then put those on. Now for my bottom lash line, I'm going to be using all the colors I used previously in my crease and I'm just going to be putting that right on the lower lash line. I'm now I'm going to be using the Ulta Beauty setting spray and I'm going to apply that before I apply some highlighter. And for highlighter, I'm going to be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit. I'm going to be using those two shades and just applying that to where it's needed. Now I'm going to be using a red lip liner along with a Lorac Ultra Eco Lip Gloss. Applying that and here's the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe. Bye guys!